Hey guys, Sage is the Universe here, so welcome to my AMV making tutorial. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Teen Audios on Instagram. So basically I'm just searching around trying to find a song I like right now. So this could take a while. Um, so while I'm doing this, I'm just going to explain what's going on with my account. I'm in contact with Instagram and I'm talking with them about what's going on. They need a bit more proof before they know it's me. So, um, yeah, hopefully I'll have my account back by the new year, so, um, yeah, if anyone has any tips for, you know, getting your account back, that'd be great. So, once you find the song you like, you're going to go ahead and copy the URL, then you're going to go to vid to mp3, I will link it on screen and down below. You're going to paste that in. Hit fetch video and wait for this to load. This can take a while. Normally it doesn't, but sometimes it can take up to 10 minutes. Uh, select click here to download and download mp3. Then go to YouTube and search for the clips that you, er, ugh, go to cl open clip converter CC, go to YouTube and look for the clips you like. Uh, repeat the same step, copy and paste that in and then hit download. But we'll start then hit download again and that will download that and close out of any extra links it takes you to you can repeat this as many times as you like uh, just until you know you have all the clips you need so copy the URL paste it in wait for it to load then hit download X out of any extra links it takes you to uh, you can drag those onto your home screen, but it's not necessary. Ignore my cursor spazzing out. Sometimes it does that. Like, it will freeze and, you, like, pfft. Yeah, so then I'm going to uh, hit the plus arrow, movie, no theme, and then I'm just going to go ahead and drag those in. I don't know why I accidentally opened another tab. Probably because it was an accident. So, yeah. And making sure that you download your audio as an mp3 is very important. You can also use things from iTunes. So I start by dragging in the audio. The next thing I'm going to do, um, I pretty much just listen to the clip and think about some clips. I listen to the audio and think about clips I'd like to use. Then uh, I basically go in and I grab all those clips. I put them in. I hit the little audio button, which I will attempt to show you. Um... I click the little audio button and I mute the audio on that. So yeah, uh, once I've done that, incredibly boring process of muting the audio on every single video, it's time to actually start the edit. So the next thing I'm going to do is use an overlay. You can just Google uh, AMV overlays. So then make sure the clip is the same length as your video and drag it above. Now you're going to lower the opacity as much as you like. Um, you can mess around with the other features. Normally, I just use cutaway. You can use green screen. I will upload a tutorial on how to use green screen in a bit. Um, but yeah, I don't know what I'm doing here. I don't understand how to really use iMovie completely. Most of my AMVs just come from me messing around. So next, we're going to add the watermark. Uh, choose what you want. Make sure it uh, is in the corner. I'm just going to replace that part with spaces, then I'm going to type in my username. Then I'm going to go to fonts and scroll down to the bottom, select my fonts, use the ones from the web, and hit the font. Make sure that the uh, text is selected, see? I generally make it small, and you can modify the color if you want. I will upload a tutorial on downloading fonts uh, soon, too. I don't really know. So, yeah, then I just export it, and that's how I make an AMV. Thanks for watching. Bye!